If you're in business, you shake a lot of hands. So what does your handshake say about you and the people you're doing business with? Find out as we count down the top 10 bad business handshakes. Here we go with number 10, the sweaty palmer. A potential deal breaker, you can't escape this nervous, sweaty grip fast enough. Yes, wipe that off. Number 9. The Lobster Claw When this person shakes your hand, they pinch your hand between their thumb and fingers. It's as if they're picking up a canopy. Definitely no good if you're allergic to shellfish. At number 8, we've got the Fist Bump. Nothing says I'm business savvy like a fist bump. And exploding it? Well, that's just not suitable at all, ever. Number seven, the wrestler. He flips his hand on top of yours to assert his dominance. Rumor has it, this is the guy who put the I in T. At number six, it's the phantom. Wow, that was quick. Let's slow it down to see what happened there. Aha. Uh -huh. Clearly, she's got more important places to be and more important people to see. The lingerer drops in at number five. There's shaking hands and then there's holding hands. Obviously, the lingerer has no idea which is which. Awkward. Number four. The decliner. Decliners are fastidious folk. They won't touch a doorknob without sanitizing it, let alone shake hands. Number three. The tickler. Everything appears normal enough, and then something feels a bit odd. It's their middle finger stroking the palm of your hand. In second place, it's the vice. Once you escape the crushing grip of the vice, you can't help but feel sorry for him. He must feel terribly inadequate to shake hands like that. And here it is. The worst of the worst. The bottom of the barrel. The handshake only a mother could love. The dead fish. If handshakes say something about you, this one has to say you're a limp-wristed pushover who's easily battered into submission. Business.gov.au has the tools and templates to help plan, start and grow your business so you don't get off to a shaky start.